Hi guys, this is BMW Chris W. Today we'll be doing a complete video review of the 2018 BMW X1. This video will show you the complete presentation of the all new X1. Let's get started. Let's get started. This is the beautiful Estoro Blue Metallic. Here's a couple angles from the side so you can see a little bit of it. model you can see the character line going down the side there those are your 19 inch rims here's a shot from the back you see you have the dual exhaust pipes back there what a gorgeous vehicle so like I said, this is a brand new car. There's your rear privacy glass back there, black roof rails, beautiful 19 inch rims. So the M Sport line gives you those very beautiful M front bumpers, black grills. Let's have a look inside, shall we? Here's the interior. This is the black Dakota leather. And these are the sport seats here. Everything is controlled down here. So this is actually your adjustment for the side bolsters to kind of hug you a little bit more. Okay, heated steering wheels back there as well. This is your Napa leather wrapped M leather steering wheel. Here's a little bit of the trim on the inside. This is the beautiful brushed aluminum trim. Very, very smooth, very nice high quality. Okay. There's your climate controls. This is your iDrive right here. Everything is controlled by the screen over here. This is the newest generation of the iDrive. Everything is touch screen here and it's very fast responding as you can see. It responds instantaneously. You can even go back to the home icon here. You can press this button. You can actually move the tiles around how you wish. And everything is very, very fast, very, very intuitive. There's no lag. It responds instantaneously, which is the, one of the main advantages of the BMW iDrive being the best infotainment system in the business, especially if you look at the maps. The maps are very, very high quality, very, very crisp. There's your traffic information there as well. Ultimately, it's just the best navigation system in my opinion. Another interesting feature right here is your active damper control, okay? This is, you'll adjust from comfort to sport or echo echo mode here. And if you see here, so the car will always start off in comfort mode, and then you can go up here to go to sport mode or down for echo pro mode. Okay, so the main difference is comfort is gonna be, the steering wheel is gonna be nice and loose, gas pedal, the brake pedal is gonna be nice and, and loose and comfortable. Everything is, all about the car is gonna be very uncomfortable, okay? What's gonna happen is immediately when you put it into sport mode here, is you have an option here to put on the sport displays which gives you these really nice displays they're very high quality and very responsive the graphics are unbelievable and what essentially sport mode does is it's going to happen it's going to tighten up your steering wheel okay so the steering wheel is going to be more more harder and more more and more accurate the gas pedal and the brake pedal is going to be more sensitive so you want to push it as far to get it going and because this is an electronically controlled all-wheel drive system it will send any it'll send a little bit more power to the rear wheels when you put the vehicle into Echo Pro mode, it saves the car about 20% fuel, depending on how you drive. Here you can actually adjust the different modes, how you'd, what, what you want activated and what you want not activated. It tells you on the bottom right your efficiency. So what happens is coasting is basically you're driving on the highway, you take your foot off the gas, the RPMs of the car drop all the way down to right about where they are now, and it's, it's coasting. So essentially it utilizes the energy that's going in through the car it charges the battery and that battery then charges the electronics rather than just having the RPMs you know sit a little bit there and it makes the car more fuel efficient another way you can do this is by the climate controls if you turn this feature on and off it reduces the HVAC going through the vehicle to make it more fuel efficient the speed warning up there you can change what kilometer just to warn you if you're going a little too fast your storage areas are down here there's your cup holders you can probably you can fit a phone down there as well Underneath the armrest here, you have your USB down there, additional storages. You can adjust the height of the armrest to whatever you feel is more comfortable. Down here, you have your, a little more storage there as well. 
Here's a little bit of the back. This is about where I'd normally have the driver's seat to drive. You can see here I have plenty of leg room back here. You have some drink storage here as well. Everything is opened up here. Very nice comfortable interior back here. Lots of room. Rear air vents are there as well. And you have a great view of everything up front here. Here we are at the back of the vehicle. This is what the key looks like here. This is the M Sport key with a nice logo there. Okay, there's a cool trick I'm going to show you. When you have access, you can actually keep the key in my pocket right here. Okay, if you walk up to the car with the key in your pocket, you just give a little bit of a kick down below. It's up the tailgate for you. Okay, this is the comfort access. So there's a trick. There's a sensor just underneath there. You kick it, and it'll open and close the the trunk. Here's a little bit of the space inside here. You have additional storage down there as well. Okay, I just put the mats and everything down there. You can fold this up. You can see you have quite a lot of room down there as well as the hidden storage. A little net over here as well. Some more storage over there. This, also this you can come out. This is just a co cover for the, the, the cargo here. That you can take out if you wanted to fold the seats down. Let me show you what that looks like. Now. Folding the seats down is quite easy. You just pull on the little handle down here and the seat pops right back down. Here's what the vehicle looks like with the seats folded down. You have quite a large amount of cargo space in here, as you can see. You can fit a lot of stuff back here. Another interesting thing you can do with the headrest is there's a button right here. You can press it and it folds the, the top headrest down just in case you want a little more visibility from the back. Or if your rear passengers want more comfort, they can put the headrests up. So the car is available at the time of this video. This is the 2018 model. This vehicle has the M Sport I driver assist package and premium package enhanced. The link details of all of the contents of these packages will be in the video description below. So once again, this is BMW Chris W. That was a video walk around of the 2018 BMW X1 M Sport line. It was available at the time of this video. You can contact me just off to the side. My email is there or you can call the dealership. BMW here in St. Catharines and this was a video review to show you more around the 2018 X1. There are great incentives going on right now. If you're in the GTA area or in the St. Catharines, Niagara region, Burlington, Hamilton and you're looking for a BMW, you can give me a call, contact me. I can do a video review just for you just like this one, give you more information about the car as well as a complete presentation and I'll be the one that can take you for the BMW experience test drive that is exclusive to our dealership. So once again, thanks for watching guys and I hope you enjoyed this video.